Welcome to San Diego Market Movers. I'm your host, Valley, and I'm here with Kurt Uli Kindy. Welcome. Thank you. Good to see you again. Okay, so we have discussed quite a bit here on this show about the NAR settlement, but there's also a new requirement by law when you're viewing or holding an open house. That's correct. So can you kind of cover all basis of what the rules are in regards surrounding open houses? Sure. We're not going to get into buyer broker's agreement, but as far as open houses, you're always used to going and looking at open houses, just walking in. You can no longer do that, and it's actually the law. So what you have to do is you have to state your name, mm -hmm. your email address, and your phone number. If, I guess if you don't have one, you put whatever you've got. Mm -hmm. And whether you have an agent working with, the, with you already, mm -hmm. okay? So if not, you say no agent, and then the, the form says, this declares that the person allowing you to view this house mm -hmm. is not your agent, okay? Mm -hmm. So I'm not allowed to discuss anything about the property with you until I enter an agreement mm -hmm. to be your agent. Okay. So you're literally going through and seeing what's there, seeing what's on the flyer, and I get to smile and go, oh, yeah, this is nice. Mm -hmm. If you'd like to discuss it further, then we need to take the steps legally further to the new 13-page buyer-broker agreement. Wow. So it's a big deal. And, and agents are being fined beginning uh, uh, September 18th. Mm -hmm. That's the end of the grace period, and we do have people actually monitoring. So it's very, very important that when you see an agent asking you mm -hmm. to sign this, it's not that we're just trying to gather your information. It's mm -hmm. the law, and we're going to be asked to submit those forms. So. Wow, wow. Okay. So an open, if you're, a lot of people are still just going to open houses. Mm -hmm. um, so if they go to an open house and they don't have a buyer broker agreement, yep. the person that's hosting the open house cannot give them any information. They could say, hi. How's your day? Well, we can't discuss. We can't discuss the home. So what's mm -hmm. what's printed on the flyers is that's public material. Mm -hmm. You've got that, but and this is taking a lot of reeducation for all of us mm -hmm. agents too. Yeah. So. Um, yeah. So if there's plants, people need to be aware. But also, more importantly, if you're a buyer looking to buy a home, just reach out to an agent, preferably Kurt, and he'll help you go see any home you like. Yeah, and I just wanted you guys to understand that this isn't this isn't some tactic from the realtors trying to gather your information. We, it really isn't. It's mm -hmm. just a, de a declaration that you're being unrepresented mm -hmm. and that the agent that's hosting the open house, if it's the listing agent, represents the seller only right now. Mm -hmm. And um, so they just can't discuss a whole lot with you. Oh, man. All right. You guys heard it. Follow the law. Right. <laughs> Thanks, Kurt. Thank you. Thanks, guys.